I've been in episode one jail all night. Almost an hour now. We gotta just call one and go for it here. Okay, that'll do. Let's go. Sub-17, let's go. This might be Tetter. Brick, please. Yeah, that was a real, that was a fast brick. Where's the tower? Anything on the top layer gone on the first shot, it opens up. Nope, that's not gonna do it. What the heck? What the heck? That second one doesn't even make sense. Okay, I lost time because I had one miss drop, then I got a second one that was me trying to correct for the first one. Okay, we're green. Let's play it from here. Let's just ride it the whole way from here. We might be done by 10 o'clock central if we do that. Okay, there we go. I was a little worried that one was gonna spiral out of control, but it worked out okay. Let's go. Where are the drills? Where are the drills? That's it. That's where we need to be. Too many squares. I need to get rid of this gigantic operation of bills that's down here. We are getting some serious slowdown because of how much is going on around the ball. Which way go? Just start firing. I think that's it. No, no, it is okay. Lucky, because otherwise we're gonna be just going pieces for a while. Then. All right, where are the drills? I just need to find them. This is just a giant. Good start. This is a good start. Oh. Gonna lose some, I think we're gonna lose some ground here, but that time I cannot run against that time. Yeah, let's look like that. That second split is really good. We have 35 seconds to save on this split. Of course, that's gonna be dependent on not having just all my all the uh, pieces at the beginning be the wrong piece. Um, here we go again. I can't work with this because there's just too many. It's just a tease for a day, and all I need to do is move this. Okay, and that, but too many teas. Just sitting there dropping pieces because I cannot get the one I need. It's five away in the uh, freaking queue.
one. Stages. Come on, come on. I just need to make sure this is not that one. There's definitely way too much of this nonsense hanging around. Just look at all those yellows. Not. And I just need to get the last one, which is going to be somewhere in this vicinity. There we go. Doesn't seem like we're going to be saving a lot of time here. Behind gold already. We're back in the green. It wasn't like amazing, but we're back in the green. This is a gold play on this one, so... Thing into the right position. There we go. Now we should have a unique and then a tower. We might actually get a gold on this, save some time. If I can figure out what 
attack on your wings. Nope, no gold. I'm real close, but I got hung up on the wrong piece again. But we're okay, there's a lot of time to save in the back of the game. A lot. just need to stop worrying so much about the beginning of the game and start just playing stuff out even if it doesn't look super great out of the game. I gotta remember when I see that T fork up, just go a little down and it's just one. that I haven't that is good but also one I haven't overground into death into death. Okay, this is the world with the crystal tower and I've been getting wrecked on that lately. I should have cleared that stick out before doing that drop. I didn't read it quite right. All right, so let's see how this looks. One, two, three, four. What? I did not. Did not even. I didn't even. There we 
we go. Okay. Now, I'm hoping again by the end of this connect to have a slightly different power up than what I have. This is not for this unique not connect, but I'm hoping again to get a good chance to upgrade my power up here. We've been getting very compact connect today. Much sprawlier patterns this year. No, I don't want this many blues. I should do it. Alright, so this here is the power up I want the least in this situation. Oh, I just vacuumed up the. Uh, Second, the next power up in the set. That's gonna hurt. Um, get these out of here as best as we can. Any more squares that we care about? Yeah, they're there. Yeah. Okay. 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 What do we have any more green to do? Now, what can we do over here? There we go. That worked. We're gonna get wrecked on this one, probably. Nice if we got that power up to stack. We could have had some pretty nice time save. Unless throw this in the deepest pit we can. So, so many yellows. Save some time. Not a goal. Not a goal. But we'll save some time. Okay, so this is a good time for a sip and a stretch because I cannot do anything to make this faster. So we're gonna stretch. And we are. Yeah, we still got over an hour to go. The first episode is, yeah, not the, as it says, not the real challenge. This chapter is substantially shorter gameplay-wise than the one we just finished. If it looks longer, that's because of that cutscene we just tried to mash through. Alright, I do not need nearly this many squares. Ugh, squares, I don't want this square. I don't want any of these squares. Just need them out of here. Okay, that sucked. That sucked real bad. I'm already writing this chapter off as a loss. Unless we get like. Okay, can't even find a drill, much less the right one. Well, there's three of them. Figure it's probably up here, and again, just a confluence of squares that nobody asked for. It was the fifth place we looked, but at least a bunch of them were all bundled together, so it didn't take as long as it certainly could have. We need to be working southward. Still, too many squares when what I need is to get this out of the way. And just need one more drop here. Okay, that one, that one was tricky. 
feel like we're bleeding time on this episode, but we'll see. For this level. This set. Alright, where's the brick? Hey, 68k heart. Eh, it's going okay. I, we're, uh, I, it's hard to get a run going because I those first splits are so tight, and then this chapter has not been what I would call amazing. Uh, but we're trying to get one. It's a pretty RNG heavy speed run, honestly, and you pay for that a little bit. Tower is gonna be a bit of a dead too. But it's also the weekend, so we got that going for us. Alright, so what can I do with this? Still really jammed up over here. There we go. But we're gonna we're losing time already, so we can probably get out of this green. But it's gonna be a, a split where we lose some time. There's a lot of time to save in the back part of the run, though, so it's harder to get the world. I don't like what I'm seeing here. So. Throw that power up. It's also better not to overstore your power up. I found that out. Do it, he only needs a two right here. I don't really consider this a Tetris game, but yeah, there's a there are definitely many points of RNG, and it's not just the pieces and the ball. The pieces are RNG, the ball layout is RNG. Which types of stages you get are not RNG, but what? But how they turn out for you is RNG. That missed drop hurts, and it wasn't even something I'm willing to take credit for. That was just the game deciding to punish me for whatever reason by being laggy. Which it does. Very often. Oh boy. That's not good. Same thing, the game is punishing me by being laggy for no discernible reason. Okay. to the beauty of N64 games. Okay, we're done. So the uh, the Atom, the fourth level power-up that peels off the entire outer layer of the ball, that one is very much situationally useful. These stages are prone to enormous amounts of time loss, just because of how long it can take to get a decent, uh, or how long it can take just to find the core. But, yeah, the, the fifth power of the two-tier bomb can be okay. But, like, I think the magnet is honestly worse than the, uh, I'm just using the rocket. What? I dragged that piece once again. Once again, it's just, like, causing me all kinds of misdrops. One, I, I, 
Okay, that one, I probably just read it wrong. But we're also to the point where I gotta start playing it safer. Oh, that should do it. There we go. Yeah, this is looking like we're gonna be behind after this episode, especially when I'm mashing around waiting for it to actually start responding, and then it starts responding, but it's kind of late. I'm griping a lot, but I keep coming back to the speedrun because I am, in fact, having a lot of fun with it. But it's not easy. Too many zigzags. There's three. Where's the fourth one at? I lost track of the fourth one. It's over here. I just need to get this over here. Yeah, look at how much, uh, look at how red we're gonna be coming out of this split. I'm just glad there's a lot of time to save in the back half, but... So we're gonna need a 3 by 3 here. No, we're not. No, we're not. We're at three. Okay, that could have been worse. This one's still a gold that we're running against, so that again makes things difficult. Use this because I want to grab that firecracker immediately afterward, but yeah, in general I do not like the uh that one I just grabbed, the magnet. I think it looks worse than that should do it though. There we go. Yeah, the firecracker uh, can be hard is hard to use. The magnet I think is worse than just the rocket is. But we're gonna actually save this up. This power up and up. We're gonna save it for 3-3 and try to build it up to an atom. I literally can't actually see. First time pressure. So at this point we really, really, really want to save that power up. Losing it is gonna be a massive time loss on the next stage. There we go, good enough. So we do need the power up to be one tier higher, though. Just right here. All right, clean. Connect is the one where you got to move the furthest around the ball. So having um, having uh, a atom to peel off the outer layer is very beneficial. That one, I'm pretty sure it's kind of over in this area. It is. And then this other one is going to end up being somewhere in this vicinity. This is all memorization that I'm doing here for where they're going to be. You, can, you don't know which connect pattern you're going to get when you get in the level, but when you dig down to the core, the way the lines radiate out can tell you what your connect pattern is going to be. Okay, this sucks because I don't need this. Yeah, 
we're still gonna be red here. Looks like we're gonna lose a little more time on this split too. But we can do this. No, we really didn't lose any time there. Okay, so we got time to save on this one. Ball's getting much taller. Other rocket before the one rocket is done firing. Go. Don't overthink it, just get it uncovered and move on. So we should be on to your shift. First thing I'm looking at when I get to shift is how spread out is everything going to be. So now we should be back to another unique. Happy that we started some in the vicinity of what we need to see. Uniques can also take quite a bit of time and they can get sprawly, but they are, there are definitely compact patterns with the unique. Alright, I can't use this. I don't have anything I can do with this. Probably should have done was fired my power up a little more quickly. So. Let's burn this. We have a rocket going into tower. It's really helpful. Of course, we gotta find the tower first. That's always the hardest part of tower. I think it wouldn't be because it should be protruding from the ball, but also we're at five layers deep, so it's not protruding all that hard anymore. Okay, we got a power up fighting down here, so. We did not want the dynamite, but We'll work with it. I'm gonna fire this right here. to make a dent on this next one. 
That's gold, but I might. Pretty well. Okay, I'm really glad to see this. Yep, this is, this is a relatively deep ball. That was real disappointing when I saw that I wasn't getting any L's, but that it did eventually go away. The one crystal? Uh, talking about the crystal tower or something else? We got the crystal tower coming up, and that, yeah, that is... That is the point of fear in this run. Alright, let's do this. Oh, the one crystal block that was blocking the image. Yeah, I had to slide that around. At least I saw it. It can be really, really annoying if you uh, don't see that for a while. Okay, come on, come on. So, I need to focus more on this other side, but that also means we need dig through a little bit. Okay. What? Okay, so A, I think I lost a power-up. Even if I didn't, B, I have... More to the point, I had to go find another. I had to wait for another S to come up. Yeah. Mm, nah, gotta work just a little harder. Alright, where actually I need to find the drill rather than just playing here. Okay, that drill is a problem. I cannot actually. What the heck? It's not where I dropped that ball. Anyway, double drills usually are a pretty good place to go looking. They have a higher than typical odds of giving you what you want. What you want is the picture. We got four minutes to get through the next two things, although one is a connect, which is gonna mean we are really gonna want some power-ups. Okay, getting two of them right there is actually going to be very helpful. Throwing these a little bit of feel is actually more helpful in this case than it would be in many other stages. We're not... That's not wasted work because we are at some point here going to have to spread out. It's on a way. We need to figure out which ways this is to go. Moving off into this quadrant, trust me on this, we have a very good reason for doing this. We are essentially exactly where we need to be. Approximate guesstimation was a little bit better than an approximate guesstimation. I pretty much nailed exactly where we needed to go. 
Again, when I see the line going right and down, I know they're gonna basically cross over each other and eventually meet again. But it's gonna be quite a distance off the ball. That'll be useful in the next stage, but it's not as useful quite right now. There we go. Okay, we have we have a solid goal awaiting us here. Like as much as a minute. Uniques have more variance. The connects, if you want to go fast, you have to be able to look at where the lines go and figure out where you need to go. And you're hoping for a connect pattern that only actually makes you dig up two things. Some of them make you dig up as many as four. So that's again where a lot of the RNG of the run kicks in. because I was mashing. I hate that. I hate that so much. Alright, so... It happens to me regularly. Um, I just need to get better. Okay, not that one. I love this one. Nope. This is the... This is my least favorite part is... Spinning the ball to find all the drills it could be. Okay, it's the top one. It is definitely the top one. I always eyeball it just to make sure because there's a there's one part of it it can give you where you get kind of a little gray corner that's almost indistinguishable. Uh, so you, I always like to actually make sure that I. Get pro get full visual idea. Alright, here we go. Yeah, it is quite difficult to play this game fast. I just blame it being an N64 game and the N64 being, you know, the N64. We should do it, though. We should be quite going into crystal. I would not 
not be surprised. Alright, where is it? Where it where is the demon spawn? So what we wanna do with crystal is we wanna start working away from the ball, but really what we wanna do is here's a little trick. If I do this little if I do this a uh, little double tuck here with the fuse. I lost it. So if I, I'm gonna sh swap these, and then in and out, it counts it as simultaneously both a fuse combo and a gravity combo. And I only just found out about, oh, this needs to be here. I only just found out that there's that meter in the uh, top right. Or the, not the top right, the middle right, that little, uh, thing pointing from the combo counter to the clock, there's a little meter there, and that meter uh, is another way to get power-ups. And you get power-ups with that by just doing stuff, but making these fuse combos fills it rather quickly. So I can just use those fuse combos to start picking up rockets which do not damage the crystal tower. So we get through the crystal tower really fast and relatively safely. Let's throw this rocket down here. Yeah, I didn't invent any of that strat, I just watched the world record holder, FFR Pro, doing it. And it's like, oh! I was afraid to throw power-ups at the Crystal Tower, I did not know you could do that. Why would, and why would I try to do something so patently dangerous? So let's get this cleaned up. It's not a big goal, but it is a goal, and it's a big it's a big time save from PB for sure. Okay, one more chapter to go in this run, and we get a little water break. So there is a episodes one to three run. World record is about 115. There's an episodes one to five run. World record for that is three and a half. So adding two more chapters adds. Or, like basically triples the length of the run and no thank you. So Yeah, that's the biggest breather we get right there is between those episodes. You cannot skip that cutscene. Also, if we stick to episodes one through four, we never have to deal with three or four pieces on piece types on the ball. Um, we never have to deal with, we never really have to feel the time pressure of the clock. We can just focus on playing fast. The game gets a lot more difficult in chapters 4 and 5. So with the wild card, you gotta be careful with your drops. You can drop a non-wild card in a basically arbitrary position. Like, I can set it off to the side below the squares, and it'll go. If I have a wild card off to the side of the squares, it won't detect that, it, that I wanted to drop a square, and it will basically just throw it in. One drill. Nope. Okay, we're going over here. Two drills. Nope. Three more to go. Gotta start just throwing things down. Now yellow time. It's only three of the drills. Okay, here they are. Was that one? Okay. We can play with that. Not bad. 
Flim Flam. I wrote a BMS file to this song way back in the day. I'm not sure if I still have it. I probably do. Slightly fewer squares, please. Squares, please. That's all I want to do is get... And now I need... Turns out I do actually need a square. Not the best brick. Hey, Neil Voss nailed this soundtrack. Alright, so this should be a tower, and I'd much rather have a rocket than what I have. Also, the tower is probably going to be difficult to find because it might very well be flush with the ball. Nope. Alright, so we're going to come down here. And we do not want to do that power-up farming thing here. It's not time effective. But if we can get a power-up... Down here, we definitely would like to use it. Okay, so we should just be able to get this out of here. There we go. Not a bad tower. Probably gonna lose time on this split looking at the situation, but. It's not bad. I mean, we're still gonna be a couple minutes ahead. Use a few fewer drains. Get a lot of them. to diagnose where is the what is the thing keeping me from being able to move on this should probably do it there we go. yeah we lost a minute that's okay though we had so much time to get to give there we still have time to save up ahead too it's not like these two chapters but a couple chapters ahead of this I... Up and actually see if I can make a bigger splash. Okay. 
Okay, we're looking for the last freaking drill. This is the situation where runs go to die. Because I have to find it. And I don't know where it is. I don't have any idea where it could be. And there's a decent chance I've already dropped it and will never find it. dropped it and we'll never find it. So we're gonna rip a layer off the ball here and see if we find anything, but we're in trouble. We're in deep trouble. There it is, actually, okay. I mean, we're already late as heck, but we did find it at least. because I needed that power up. There we go. Okay, so we have three stages, including a unique, and we need to save time on them. It's gonna be real difficult. At least we have the L blocks, that helps out a lot. Because they, they make real big combos. The Uniques have played real well with me. Leading time. At least this should be a relatively quick. I need to get a 4x4, four four, but it's a really it's a really low ball. Lag. Lag for days. Alright, we're still gold, and look at that time save. We have two and a half minutes of time to save on 3-4 there. So we don't have to worry too much about the fact that we are losing time here, time there, it's okay. I'm reassuring myself more than anything else. I have a bad perfectionist streak. So that should do it. I 
I can't drag those pieces out, but as long as there's a layer exposed above the piece, if a piece is completely covered, the only way to clear it is to slide some, is to have something directly on top of it. But if the piece is not completely covered, then you have more options. Nope, two drills. Third drill. Clearing stuff. And then I need to be, and then I need to be finding more drills. Which I'm having a lot of trouble. I haven't seen one in a while, and I'm just treading water here. Right. Is this one of the ones I've seen? Yes. Is this one of the ones I've seen? Yes. This is again, we are lost and trying to find somewhere where we missed a drill. Like here, there's a drill. And then I'm, I'm just gonna kind of play as if this is it. I'm just stuck with so many T's, and that's not gonna help me in the area. Let's see. Nope. Still missing a drill. What's over here? It took me so long to find that. I don't want to say it's always in the last place I look, but there's only five drills, and it seems to be the fifth drill way more often than it should be. The nice thing is we are gonna we are in position to carry that power up into the next this one. There we go. The nice thing is we have this uh, atom to carry into this. This is gonna be a this is a tough split to keep up with too. This is a connect. Again, we need to kind of gamble on where everything and where the uh, pattern is gonna connect up. To take a look at the at the board. And... Okay, that's interesting. It's like it cleared up from underneath me, but at least we got the power up. So the first thing we need to do. Get this, get to completely get this figured out. All right, so I feel like we probably want to go this way. Yeah, there's the line, sort of kind of in the ballpark. There we go. Another atom will help us immensely. So we peel two layers off the five layer balls, so that, again, that's really super helpful. It's kind of wrapping around here. have to hang around here just long enough to get that out of the way. And this other one is gonna kind of come down this way a little bit. Not exactly the mirror image of the one we just dug out, but kind of, sort of. I will check the chat message in a second here. It's gonna be very difficult to do that while in the middle of the world. Yeah, I mean, well, it, it's in the last place you look is supposed to mean it's in the last place you expect, but it does have that tautological meaning to it. But it is, but a lot of people use it to mean it's in the last place you would think to look. That's far from uncommon. But in my case here, it's in the last place it could possibly be more often than I think is, you know, random. There we go. One. 
Okay, that was not exactly my plan there. Get out. There we go. Yeah, we're bleeding time. I knew that was going to be a real tough split. We're going to have to make it up on four. Let's see here. Yeah, we are. Even though I didn't think we played that very badly at all, it was in fact very difficult. So. so what in the world can we do? Yeah, that was a bad split. But we're still in the green. And like we have at least looks like we have over three minutes to save on the next two splits. It ain't free, mind you, it ain't free at all, but it's doable. This many zigzags I need. Okay, what I need is gonna be. I need is gonna be these. Okay, we're good, we're good. And we got an atom going into four. Probably won't use it for shift here. We're gonna use this bomb here. Um, I guess we need to play it. We know if we can use it. So we're gonna start over in this corner. And I'll work back towards that. We go like that. Come on! Drop before I move rather than after, please. It didn't cost me anything, but it's a little frustrating. I'm gonna be careful not to do any sort of raging or anything. Just a little healthy wine, right? Just a glass of red. Okay, that's a bit of a problem, actually, because that's now blocking my view. Let's to make it so that it would not be blocking my view. So we do need to fish this one out. And then what am I missing? Which is the which one's left? Where is it? There's still one that is I cannot figure out exactly where it's supposed to be at. I lost track of, which is definitely a problem I can have on this particular stage type from time to time. Alright, where... where is it? It's up here. I'm, okay, I'm digging completely in the wrong direction. Alright, lost a little time on that. Again, I don't think I'm hitting this gold split. But we should we should still easily be able to save some time here. I feel like we're gonna 
end up having to work both directions here. This one's gonna be relatively sprawly. The real question at this point is how close are we to done on this side? past gold. I believe we're on to a tower. First find the tower. So that's a little annoying the way those don't line up at all. Let's throw this down. Unfortunately, we only got we only got the one power up, even though we should have got one for the chain and one for the one embedded in the ball. We did not get both. We only got. One. Throw that down in this direction. Nope, that's a. It's fine. That's really not anything we need to be focusing on. Anymore. What is my problem? Okay, I need a L. Yeah, I need this. Um, to get that out. All right. I'm not looking like we're gonna save a lot of time on this split. Not at all. No. Still on, still on a good PV pace, but not really much better than that. Split. We did save time. Not not the couple of minutes I would have liked, but we did save time. If we can get a really good L5, we might still have a chance to hit my target. I think a PB is pretty likely, but I do not think my target is that likely to bring this down here. Mostly, this should make the drills much easier to find. I really would have liked to save that for the next uh, the next level, but uh, one. Here. Usually, when drills start to cluster up, that means very high odds. That's where you need to be. Now I have a 
better idea of the direction we doing digging in. Here, there we are. And we enter 5-3 with the atoms, so we're right on pace for what we want to be doing here. Let's do this immediately. Especially given that all the eyes are not near me. That's what we started with is an eye, so. Visibility of all sides, and I'm not honestly 100% sure exactly where this is going to end up. So, but we should be getting another. Nope, we apparently just went right on through it. Anyway, here's one picture, so we're going to. As soon as I can actually work with that, we're gonna work with that. Come on down here and we're gonna do this. Get this T out. And then we're gonna still have to do more digging. Alright, that's being supported, which is actually really makes me happy. Alright, so then there's going to be another one just a little bit down here. It is unfortunate that we have to dig all four, but at least we don't have to go very far to do it. It's a little bit further. And I got all these T's, but they are not helping. Rocket because once again I can't actually get where I need to get. There we go. That's one of the longest stages in the game. Right now. Okay, I almost skipped a split, but that's okay. I didn't, and it was easy to undo it if I missed that up. All right, we do not need three of these. Ugh. Right, so now that we got that out of the way. I really, really wish it would stop giving me such a ridiculous number of T pieces. I can't even use them right now. What is holding this up anyway? I can't even, I can't even tell. Okay, that one was fighting me. That one was fighting me. Now we got a hide and go seek. It's gonna be again a four by four. Fine, especially because the ball is not very deep. Is 
what's holding me back? Part of it's gonna be that I'm not getting anything but I pieces to get. Now. Gold. I was not expecting that gold. We still got four minutes of time save in those previous four episodes. We bled a lot of time away there. Alright, but if we can stay on pace here, we can have a peak. That's a tree. Okay, that'll but we'll drop that there. to get the rest of the picture. And how can we do it the most efficient? Let's go like that. Let's go like that, okay. Part of the answer to this is that I definitely need to be getting fewer. Should be done except for that. There we go. I don't even think I had to go clean that. I think it chipped away on its own. Okay. Yeah. Drill. There are any of the drills. That's not very well placed for me. First try. It doesn't happen a lot. But we will take it. Okay, that sucks. Lost the power up. I think there's another power up hiding up under this one too. No, I think I have my brain is playing a little bit some tricks on me. Should do it though. Sucks that we lost that power up, but we press on. We're right at the end of the run. We need to, so we need to find the drill. There we we couldn't actually pull that piece because of the overhang, but we just need to do a little break around. Okay, we're in good shape as long as we do not flood the tower. First we have to find the tower. Where's the tower? Where's the tower? Alright, so the tower, the crystal tower is the most ominous obstacle in the run. 
So we're gonna resort to some funky tricks here to work with it. But we basically, though, we need to stay at arm's length from the tower. Okay, um, stop it. Alright, we're gonna have to... Gonna have to worry about our, uh, time, because that's a little... Clock's getting a little bit scary, a little bit dangerous, so we need to take some of these. And we need to work away from the tower, because what happens with the tower is if we break anything adjacent to the tower, it's rip rooney There we go, we got another power up. But we do have the nice little benefit that it is not rip a rooney that's not. It is not Ripperoonie if we throw a power up at the tower. So I'm doing things that allow me to farm power ups out around the outside here. So let me bring this up. Get this out of here. Get a little shuffle. Get another power up. This is just the safest way to do this. It's the way that results in the least dying the least having to start the entire run over. <laughs> Not the run, but the mission. The game over makes you start the stage over. It's not, it's not everything. Okay, we got out of that. We got out of that clean. We have a real good shot to, I don't know about goal. We might, we could. I don't remember how deep this one is, but we will definitely be PBing here. Barring a absolute catastrophe. And since this isn't the Crystal Tower, the odds of an absolute catastrophe are comparatively slim. time here last run. What? What are you doing? Come on. I do not understand what I am missing in terms of spacing at this moment. He clearly needs a little bit more space. There it is. Okay. Um, we hit the goal. We, on the strength of that level 5, we did, uh, get the sub one, uh, 120, one, not the sub 130. 